Hi everyone, I'm Jessica and welcome to my channel for the love of languages. Maybe you are a polyglot or a language enthusiast or you just accidentally clicked on this video, but whatever the case is, welcome. And I hope you'll stick around because I'm going to be talking about my latest project, which is called the 52 Pickup Challenge. And it's definitely going to be a challenge for me because my goal is to attempt to pick up 52 languages over the course of the year. So that is one per week. So it's important to clarify that I have no intention of becoming fluent or anywhere near good at any of these languages. This is strictly for my own personal enrichment uh, to be able to learn more about world languages. And 2019 is the year of indigenous languages. So now is a great time to shed some light on these languages that are not widely spoken or dying out. Uh, they really deserve our attention and I would like to highlight some of them in the series of videos. Also, this is for my viewers that might be interested in studying a new language in the near future uh, and just don't know what they want to do. Those of us who have studied languages before know what a huge time investment it is. And sometimes uh, even uh, with money, um, whenever you have to book a class with a private tutor, enroll in a course, or buy materials. So a lot of us really want to know what we're getting into before getting started. So I hope to be able to report to you after I've taken a lesson in the target language. Um, I would like to be able to tell you my experience uh, with this one lesson. It's the first and only lesson, but let's be honest, the first lesson uh, is a very, uh, makes a very big impression most of the time. Um, I hope to be able to tell you what my experience was. How did I find the pronunciation? Um, am I going to have to learn a new alphabet to be able to uh, read and write and excel in learning the language? Uh, what are some of the grammar difficulties? Um, is it a language that I'm going to do well with because I know uh, a language in that same family? Uh, what is it closely related to? Um, what resources? Uh, what, are the, what is the availability of resources? Um, and what is the availability of teachers online? Uh, is it something uh, that I'm going to easily be able to study and get far with what's available to me? So I hope to be able to answer those questions for you. And I would also like to know uh, in the comments what you would like to see me attempt and any suggestions that you might have. Um, thank you and I hope that you'll follow me on this journey and subscribe to my channel. Thanks, bye.